What's up guys, Kylo Ren here, back with another video, just kidding, it's me. Banana. So this video will be about the costume itself, let's check it out. So here's the costume all the way from China. And uh, yeah, I'm gonna take it out. I've already opened it, I couldn't help myself, I was too excited. So, yeah. here are the gloves I'll be using. Here's the little belt. Ooh. Here's the tunic and the pants. And here's the robe and the scarf. <laughs> now this costume, I went ahead and bought it on eBay from a company called Costume Base. Or they have their own website, which you can go to as well, but... I don't know about you guys. But I really trust websites. So I just went ahead and bought it on eBay. Uh, now, I initially wanted to make this costume from scratch, because you know, back before the movie even came out, uh, I thought, eh, it's just black robes, it's just whatever, it doesn't look hard. But then actually watching the movies and looking at pictures, I realized, you know, there's there's a specific pattern on the costume, and which would be hard to replicate if I were to make it myself. So I just went ahead and bought the costume. It's not too expensive. It only goes for around $180. So, you know, I just went ahead and bought it. Whatever. And I also want to have a good costume, you know? I've seen handmade color ends and... Mm, nah. That ain't gonna be me. <laughs> so yeah. Costume base. Check them out on eBay or on their website. Now the costume comes in five pieces. And uh, I'm, gonna show it. I'm gonna show them to you. So here's the first piece. Which is uh, the tunic. Here it comes with a zipper in the front, and I got a size small. Now I'm 5'10", 160 pounds, I believe, and I always go for a size smaller than usual because my shirts are medium. But for some reason, costumes, I don't know why, when you get your 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 correct size, they actually they fit bigger for some reason. So I tend to go a size smaller. So I got a size small that way it fits nice and snug and doesn't look baggy, you know. So yeah. It has the screen accurate pattern on the arms, but it doesn't have it on the torso, which by watching the movie recently, I noticed he also has this pattern on the torso. This specific tunic doesn't bring that, but it's really no big deal for me because I'm going to be wearing the robe over it most of the time anyways. But yeah, if you want a screen accurate tunic, I think x Closer has one. So you, if you want like a, a perfect screen accurate Kylo Ren costume, you might have to Frankenstein the whole thing from different companies. But I just got the costume base set because whatever, it's cheaper and uh, you know, it, it's it's cool, which you'll see later. Uh, so yeah, the tunic. Blah. Next up is the pants. So here are the pants, which are also not screen accurate unfortunately in the movie he actually wears these like shiny leather pants these are just sweats and it also has like the tunic pattern right here which he does not have them in the movie it's all this is all on the tunic and he doesn't have this in the pants but i don't know maybe they designed this costume before they actually watched the movie i don't know but it's no big deal for me because they're black i'm wearing all black it's not that noticeable maybe later on i'll get the screen accurate pants who knows Next, we got you know the coolest piece, which is the actual robe, and it's pretty long. You know, it has the hoodie. Mm. It has the same uh, you know the fabric pattern I showed you earlier. This is what makes gives the costume its pretty its look, you know. Uh, and we have the scarf. You know. Here it is. Here's the scarf, you know, the thing he wears on his back and around his neck. Whatever. And now we have the belt. It has the 
nice design right there. Pretty cool belt, connects with a Velcro on the waist. I think this is the best belt you could find right now. And last but not least, uh, the gloves, which are made by the same company. I got it all together, but they are sold separately. So you know, they got shipped together, but you gotta buy them separately. Uh, and I believe these are the you know the best um, Kylo Ren gloves you could get right now. These are actually screen accurate. Uh, they're actually better than the official Halloween costume gloves because uh, they have the you know, screen accurate pattern right there and they fit me quite well now I wanted to get a size small but they, they were out of stock so I just ended up getting a medium and it's not bad yeah they slip right in I mean they have these velcro straps but I think they're just for looks uh, they, they slide in you don't really need to do all that so yeah that's it guys thanks for watching Peace. Nah, just kidding. Of course I'm going to put it on for you guys. So here are the pants. Just <laughs> slide them right up. They're like sweats. They have this nice little pocket right here. It's actually pretty long. You know, you can stick your phone and your wallet, your keys, whatever. There you go. Hey. Next up, we have the tunic. Just put it on like a jacket. I'm a new hero in town, call me Spider-Man. Just zip it up. Next we have the robe. All like a vest. Yeah. It actually looks cool like this. You could wear this out. Like that even if you're not cosplaying, you could just wear this out. It looks like you know, it looks cool. In winter, cold winter just Hanging out, you know. Call me Coolio Ren. What's up? I have a nice little black dress. I weigh 30 pounds underneath this little black dress. Here's the belt. Which is what holds everything together. And see, this is why I got a size small. Notice how nice and snug it fits me. If I would've got a medium, it would probably be all baggy right here. <laughs> put the hoodie on first because I have to put the scarf around it uh, just wrap this shit around it's pretty hard I mean you might need some help you want it to look as screen accurate as possible but for now this is all I can do and uh, now the gloves Right in. Now in the movie, the sleeves go over the gloves, so make sure you get that. It'll look screen accurate. They don't really, the sleeves don't really stretch that much, but that's all I can do. So here's the outfit, and all I need is the helmet, the boots, and the lightsaber. Unfortunately. I don't have the boots yet. They haven't arrived. I did order them, but they haven't arrived. So that would be for another video. But for now, put on the helmet, which I still haven't done anything to it yet, but I will. I'm probably working on it as you're watching this. And there it is, cargo run. Uh, I will get a a mask that covers this neck piece and I will tie my hair up. So that's it for this video. The next video will probably be about the voice changer or the boots, whichever one comes first. I'm still waiting for them to arrive. And I still don't know what to do about the lightsaber. I mean, I wanna get the force effects um, replica lightsaber, but it's $200 and I don't wanna, I don't wanna spend that right now. So I'll probably get it eventually, but but for now, I'll probably like get a hilt or something from Toys R Us for now. Yeah, guys. Thanks for watching. Peace.